my name is Ryan. I'm the corporate chef for Dexter. You're aboard the Dexter Pro Tour. It's our virtual tour of our factory where we talk about how knives are made and manufactured. Today, we're going to talk about how to keep your knife sharp. So what's behind a, a sharp knife is when you look under a microscope and you see that edge, what you see are feathers. And when the knife is sharp, those feathers are standing up. But when that knife gets used, those feathers start to roll over. That's when you need to get into a butcher's steel. That's the butcher's steel. It keeps a sharp knife sharp, okay? That's the honing steel. So how do you use it? What you do is you take your knife, you put it flat on the butcher steel, raise it out a quarter inch, and you go heel to tip. Do the other side, flat, quarter inch, heel to tip. And you go back and forth. That's keeping that knife sharp. An easier way to do that is you take your steel, you put it down on your table, and you're gonna do the same steps. Flat, quarter inch, heel to tip, other side, flat, quarter inch, heel to tip. Getting used to that motion is the best thing that you can do in order to keep a sharp knife sharp. Thank you. Okay, Chef, thanks for that presentation. Hey, can you tell us a little bit about the differences between the two steels that you have? I noticed that one is round and the other one is a little bit flat. Absolutely. This one that I'm holding, the smooth steel, that's called the honing steel. That's going to keep a sharp knife sharp. But when those feathers roll over, now you need to get into a butcher's sharpening steel. That is either a diamond steel because it's coarse enough to remove material, or you're going to get into a sharpening butcher's steel, which is the ridges and grooves. That's the knurling process where those ridges and grooves are pressed into that steel. So this is kind of doing 50-50. Ideally, you'd want to have a sharpening steel and a honing steel. Great. Thank you so much. And should you have any other questions, feel free to buzz the guys at the shop.